guys. Good morning. Happy Thursday. It's Miss Stormy. I've got a nice reflection in my glasses. Let me try to pop those up like that. <laughs> um, I hope everybody has been doing great. Super sorry that I haven't had an opportunity to post a lot of videos lately. I've been, um, been a little bit busy, but I always want to make time for all of you because I miss everyone so much. But um, today is National Adopt-A-Shelter Pet Day, and I adopted a shelter pet um, with my family a couple years ago. And he's right here. That's Heath. He's snoozing. Heath! Come here. <gasps> That's Heath. My family and I rescued him, adopted him um, in 2018, and we love him. So in honor of that, I wanted to read a book called The Stray Dog. The author is Mark Simont, or Simon, I don't know how to pronounce it, and it's from a true story by Reiko Sasa. Okay, so this is based on a true story. It is also a Caldecott Honor book, which is a thumbs up. This is the front cover, so this is the back cover. Hmm. Looks like they are camping and having a little barbecue. And this is the spine which holds all those pages together. I'm going to put my glasses on so I can read the story better, okay? Ooh. The dog is getting into some garbage. This is the title page. So, Mark Simont was um, retelling the story. So, he's the author and he drew the pictures. So, he's um, also the illustrator. Let's see what the story is about. Like the family's getting ready to go on a trip somewhere. I wonder where they're going. It was a great day for a picnic. Oh, they're going on a picnic. What's this? asked the father. It's a scruffy little dog, said the mother. He looks hungry, said the girl. I think he wants to play, said the boy. Do you see him? peeking around the little little tree. The children played with him and taught him to sit up. They named him Willie. They kept playing until it was time to go. It looks like he's having fun, right? Do any of you have a dog or a cat or a fish or a turtle or a hamster? Let's take Willie home, said the children. No, said the father. He must belong to somebody, explained the mother, and they would miss him. Uh-oh. Saying goodbye, Willie. On the way home, the girl said, maybe Willie doesn't belong to anybody. That would be sad. During the week, all the family had Willie on their minds. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, what comes next? Thursday, and then Friday. Hmm. I think they're worried about Willie. Saturday. Oh, they decided to have another picnic. Look, they left out some food and some water for Willie. How nice. Willie, they all cried when he appeared, but Willie didn't stop. Willie was in a big hurry. Uh-oh, why is Willie running? Who's he running away from? Looks like someone's trying to catch him. Up, oh, he's running. He looks just like my dog. He has no collar, he has no leash, said the dog warden. This dog is a stray. He doesn't belong to anybody. The boy took off his belt. Here's his collar, he said. The girl took off her hair ribbon. Here's his leash, she said. His name is Willie, and he belongs to us. That's pretty smart. Oh, you don't need any words on this page. 
to figure out how everyone is feeling, right? Maybe the dog warden is frustrated. He couldn't catch the dog and take him to the, you know, to the little animal shelter pound. But the boy and the girl are super excited, and I think Willie's pretty happy too. They took Willie home and gave him a bath. And after that, they introduced him to the neighborhood where he met some very interesting dogs. He got to go to the dog park. There's all kinds of dogs. And Willie settled in where he belonged. So Willie the Stray is not a stray anymore. They adopted him, right? And that's today is adopt a shelter pet. So a shelter is a place where, um, you know, animals who don't have a home have to stay. And then, um, you know, hopefully eventually they can all be adopted, which, which would be great. So we'll say bye to Heath. Heath, can you say bye? Heath, are you so tired? Oh, there's his tail. Heath, can you say bye-bye? Oh, where's Heath? Heath, say bye-bye. Heath, no? He's too tired. Are you too tired? Say bye, everyone. Hope you have a happy Thursday. Bye, everyone. Mr. Me and Heath, wish you a wonderful Thursday. Bye.